So you want to make a game but you are on a budget. In this video, I am going to break down the best free tools for game development, covering everything from game engines to art, sound design and project management. By the end, you will have a complete set of tools to build your game from start to finish without spending a single cent. Let's get started. Every game needs a strong foundation and that foundation is a game engine. Some of the most powerful engines out there are completely free. First up, Unreal Engine. If you want your game to have a AAA level graphics, this is hands down the best option that gives you plenty of options out of the box. Unreal's blueprint system lets you create gameplay mechanics even if you have no coding experience. And if you do know how to code, the engine gives you full access to C++. With features like Nanite and Lumen for high quality lightning and textures, you can create stunning visuals. Plus, Unreal has a library of free assets that can speed up your development. It's perfect for first-person shooters, RPG and any game where visuals are a priority. Next, Godot. This open source engine is lightweight and incredibly flexible if you are looking for an easy to learn engine with a fast workflow. It uses GD script which is very similar to Python making it beginner friendly. It is perfect for 2D games, pixel art games, platformers and indie projects that don't require heavy graphics. Then there's Unity. It is great for both 2D and 3D games and has one of the largest community in game development, meaning you will never run out of tutorials, assets or plugins to help you along the way. It is great for every platform, PC, mobile and even VR projects. Unity gives you an open space where you can create anything you can imagine. So the question is, which engine should you choose? Well, it all depends on the type of game you want to make. If you need a high-end visuals and you want to utilize visual scripting, go with Unreal. If you want a lightweight and open source engine with an easy scripting language, try Godot. If you want a well-supported engine with a massive community, Unity is a solid choice. Now let's talk about assets and visuals. You don't need expensive software like Photoshop or Maya to create high quality game assets. There are incredible free tools that can get the job done just as well. For 3D modeling and animation, Blender is the standard. It's free, open source and packed with features. You can create characters, environments, animations, and even render high quality cinematic cutscenes. Whether you are sculpting models, animating movements, or creating realistic textures, Blender is all you need for 3D game assets. For 2D art, Krita is a fantastic alternative to Photoshop. It is designed specifically for digital painting, making it great for concept art, textures, and even pixel art. If you are working on 2D game and need an hand drawn asset, Krita is must have. Then there is GIMP which is another powerful image editor. If you need to edit textures, create UI elements, or do some light photo manipulation, GIMP is the way to go. It's basically free alternative to Photoshop with a lot of same features. If you are making a 2D game, combining Krita for digital painting and GIMP for image editing will give you a powerful, completely free alternative to Photoshop. Great visuals are important, but sound is what makes a game feel alive. Music, sound effects, and voiceover add an extra layer of immersion, and you don't need to spend the money to get high quality audio. For sound recording and editing, Audacity is the best free tool available. Whether you need to record voiceover, edit sound effects, or clean up the audio, Audacity has everything you need. It supports multi-track editing, noise reduction, and variety of effects to make your audio sound professional. If you want to create your own music, LMMS or Linux Multimedia Studio is a fantastic free for music composition. It has built-in instruments, samples, and effects that allow you to compose game music from scratch. Whether you are creating an 8-bit soundtrack or an orchestral background score, LMMS can handle it. And if you don't want to create your own sound effect from scratch, there are great free resources like freesound.org and OpenGameArt where you can find thousands of royalty free sounds. Adding just a little bit of ambient audio like footstep, wind or distant chatter can make your game world feel much more immersive. Starting a game is easy but finishing it, that's a real challenge. Game development takes time and without a proper organization, it's easy to get lost. That's why you need a project management tools to keep track of your progress. For simple management, Trello is a great choice. It uses simple board system where you can create lists like to do, in progress and completed. You can drag and drop tasks between them to visually track your game's progress. If you need something more powerful, Notion is all-in-one tool that can help you organize everything from game design documents to task lists and brainstorming notes. But it also works well for teams collaborating on a game. Using a project management tool will help you stay productive and motivated, ensuring that your game actually gets finished. And that's it. These are the best free tools that every indie developer should have in their toolkit. With these, you can build a game without spending a fortune. Now I want to hear from you. What's your favorite free tool for game development? Let me know in the comments. I would love to hear what you are using. If you found this video helpful, subscribe and turn on the notifications so you don't miss future videos on an indie game development. Watch our latest video, Free Game Developer Roadmap. Until then, we will see you in the next one. Bye.